guys, welcome back to Kiwi's Power Explore slash the Paravers. We are back. So it's been a while since we've actually made a video, just due to some things that have been going on. I wanted to take a little break, but we are now at a abandoned cemetery. Dave can give you some more info because I don't know too much about it. But um, yeah, we're hoping to get some good things. It's obviously night time, and uh, we're using the new camera with the infrared. So we are hoping. Um, get some good things tonight. I'm going to put the necrophonic on, we've got spirit talker, we've got a few other bits as well um, and we'll just hopefully get hopefully some, we get some good stuff. Yeah, yeah good communication on that. So we've heard, well I heard like it was saying like running coming behind us, so I sort of turned but Dave was just stood there so I was like okay. No, I didn't. <laughs> and I did hear a noise behind us again earlier and we've heard like a tap I not heard, long I ago. Heard, yeah, I heard a growl. But so. yeah, so do you want to sort of give a bit of brief like yeah. when, I don't know, how old it is and that? Uh, it was... One second, I have it here. Two seconds. It's called Barnes Old Cemetery. And it was... Opened. It was opened in 1854, two acres of sandy ground purchased by the Church of England for £10 for the £1,400 were spent on it after that. Uh, it was well used uh, during the Victorian times. A number of well uh, known Victorian families were buried here, including a large memorial to the Hedgeman family, which is actually down that way. We've passed it's one of the big ones, it's massive. It's like yeah. the centerpiece of it. They were great contributors to the areas of Barnes and would have contributed towards the construction of the graveyard, I would imagine. Um, there's also uh, one famous murderer here, of, and that's the Victorian murder of Julia Martha Thomas, who was murdered in 1879 by her Irish maid, who was, I suppose, she fired her, let her go, she was fairly disgruntled about it, murdered her, she hit her over her head um, and then she I think, boiled the flesh off oh, her bones it, yeah. and then sold her fat and a lot of oh, gruesomeness yeah, then she then fled to, fled to Ireland and then she was eventually <laughs> apprehended and brought back she tried to plead that she was pregnant and anything to get off but eventually she was hanged um, Julia Martin Thomas's head wasn't found until 2010. It was actually discovered by Sir David Attenborough in his garden in 2010. So <laughs> mad, isn't it? That's how long ago. And they found the rest of her body, but she's uh, she's probably so, such a famous Victorian murder. Like it's right up there with Jack the Ripper murders. This would have been a well known back then because of how gruesome it was. Like Kiwi said, like mm. it was such a gruesome like to kill someone and then to boil their boil their uh, flesh, flesh off their bones and then sell their try and sell 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 their fat to anything and everything. Um, the cemetery was I suppose the last burial was 1954. Then nothing was because rising costs and lack of space. Um, then it was shut down. And, uh, yeah, it was kind of overgrown. The, it was bought by the council, London Borough of Richmond on Thames. Uh, they bought in 1966. Tore down the old uh, monastery that was here, the old chapel and the railings, and then they were planned on turning into kind of a grassland cemetery where only like head height, uh, about tiny headstones would have been visible, for, like a lawn cemetery, similar, similar to like uh, Arlington in America or something like that. You know, lawn kept. Yeah. But nothing ever happened since 1966, and uh, they kind of just abandoned it. it was left yeah. abandoned there for about 30 years and. Okay. Now it's kind of trimmed back, and I say a lot of work done by the locals and film students come here, art students come here and film it. But, uh, Do photography and stuff like that. Photography, well. yeah. There's some notable names: be Alexander Joseph Fein Alexa Alexander Joseph Feinberg, <laughs> James Haywood, Charles Inns, uh, who designed the church and Barnes, Augustus Matthew, Ebenezer Cobb Marley, Francis Turner. Pelgrave, Henry William, Parkhill, Julia There's loads Thomas, of names. So yeah. 
what I will do. <laughs> oh, well, your as well. This intro is going to go on and on and on. So what I'll do is put all the info in the Link description below, yeah. below. So obviously you can go and read it in your own time. We just wanted to sort of brief you on it. Uh, obviously there's some other things that have gone on, but there's, we'll yeah, talk about it when we're doing the necrophonic and things like that. But enjoy the video. We're going to sort of set up and get going. Going. Oh, shit. Okay. Yeah. Sound like running, that's why I turned to yeah. you. Right, just stay shush for a minute. If there's anyone following us, can you run or walk towards us right now? Stay absolutely still, do not move. We've been hearing noises. Are you following us? I'm keeping it on anyway. Where did we turn? Left of that angel Oh yeah. Behind us. Up there, that looks like something for. Is that a headstone? Hmm. Is it? That's a like tree. That's a headstone of some sort. Bum. Yeah, you can see there's bits there as well. Oh, I'll tell you that, I think. Bum. Yeah, look, it's a couple of them. Ah, yeah, there you go. Bum. Right, going this way. Robert yeah. Barty Brown. Yay! Yeah. 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 Right, I just wanted to get this here. Yeah. It's a weird sign, isn't it? Yeah, it's a sideways cross, I don't know what it's like. Can't see. Right, there's a stone there. If there's anyone around us, make yourself known. It appears a form of.
you make a noise around us, throw something, tap, make a twig, snap. Let us know you're here. We're not here to harm you. We're only here to communicate with you. You can tell us your story, what happened to you. If you're lonely, you can talk to us. It's the church bell. Oh yeah. We Careful the puddle, yeah. Are you sure? No. Nope. Also, remember guys, if you hear anything that we may have missed, let us know in the comments. And if you can, make sure you timestamp it as well, so we can click back and listen to it. Or look at it. <laughs> Sophia Moore. She said he passed away. 19th of July, 1934, age 53 years. Okay, so Dave just heard what sounded sort of like a gallop. Yeah. Like a horse if it was galloping from over there. If there's anyone here, can you show yourself for us? Can you make a noise? Right, everyone, quiet. If there is someone here, or the nun, can you copy me and whistle? <whistles> there is a um, sports field next to us. So obviously that's all the noises you can hear, so we do apologise for the background noise there. Of course we didn't know it was a football pitch episode. No. I thought it was a lot more. No, the good thing is it gives us a car park right next to it. So, so we've access to it. <laughs> so you can park right up and come in. Can you whistle? Let's have to come up on this. Yeah. Hello spirits. Harry? Not sure that's hello. Sounded Harry. I heard Harry. <laughs> Is your name Harry? My name's Melissa, also known as Kiwi, and I'm with David. Hello, Spurs, could you tell us your name? What's your name? Presence. Very presence. Is your presence here? Is there a nun here at the cemetery? Can you tell 
us whose grave she goes to. Or has seen it. Yeah, didn't it? I just said Dave. I heard the. Uh, I've got cold, and I'm not even cold. Right on the front of me, not even the back, just the front. Are you near us right now? Are you near me? Yes. Julia Martha Thomas. Julia? Martha Thomas. Julia Thomas. Julia Martha Thomas, are you here? She's murdered in 1879. She's the one who's not. Was she the one that was murdered? She's the murdered in 1879 by her uh, Irish. Her Irish uh, maid. She let the maid go, the maid was disgruntled the murderer. Who she killed you? Or who killed her? I heard Julia, did you? I was just listening to Zach then, so. It was known as the Barnes Mystery. She was 50 years old when she died. So she was a wealthy woman at the time. Yeah. Who killed Julia? She was killed by a woman called Kate, Katie Webster, a 30 year old woman. Katie Webster is the one who murdered her and threw her remains into the River Thames. Yeah, we're not far from the River Thames. So deep. Did their remains go deep in the River Thames? Nelson? I heard Nelson. Katie Webster, are you here? Yeah. Katie Webster. Did I say don't? I heard it sounded sound like an Irish accent, something there. I it picked up a woman saying Irish. Are you here with us, Katie? We're not afraid of you. I'll leg it in a minute. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm not afraid of you. Stop. Oh, in just a got... minute. In a minute. Jen. Oh, I just got cold breeze in the back of my legs. On the back. So Mum was the front just now. And I'm just fine. Got, just got cold. I think a cold breeze right in my back Katie, right now. Katie, are you behind David? Are your, your footsteps that we heard earlier on following us around? Is my accent familiar to you, Katie? I'm also from Ireland. Yeah, you can show you like... Chair, talk. I hear talk. Do you want David to talk to you? Can you uh, copy me if I whistle? <laughs> Getting cold breeze in the back of my neck. There is a cool breeze, but I think it feels different. Look, it's barely blown, but I'm getting a strong breeze in the back. My back is abs right next to my face, right here, is absolutely freezing in my right shoulder. Let's change. Yeah, got poo on the hand. Hey, poo on the Stand back. 
All right, Dave's turn. <clears throat> He's been feeling a cool breeze down the back of him and like someone's blowing on his neck. Going right here and going down. On the back of my legs, kind of here and up here. And it's it's not just a cold breeze. It's getting like an ice, ice cold. You know when you, if you open the fridge or anyone went into like a fridge. It just said coat. Right now. And when we're in, cold. When right we're in here. Bedham. Right now. Freezing cold right here. When we're in Bedham, someone actually pulled your coat, didn't they? They did. They pulled it. It felt like a child tugging on it. Yeah. Tugging on the bottom of my coat. So I had a long black coat. And it got tugged on. Who's with David? Can you show yourself? Are you strong enough? Right, can you not like stamp your feet and stuff? Because we need quiet. I'm here. Sure. Woman. Is there a woman here? There is. Girl or kill? Katie, are you here? Katie, my name's David. Did you murder Julia because she let you go? Did you feel you were dismissed unfairly? I can hear the odd noise. Let's say David. But it's hard to hear over there, big gobs. Can you show yourself next to David, even if it's an orb going past him? Stand next to me. I'm watching you film. Careful, Joe filming. Yeah, I'm going down. <laughs> Gotta get the bum shot. Yeah, I will. <laughs> Why did you feel you had to murder Julia? This is your only way you're going to be able to tell your story. Why did you murder her? Julia, are you here? Bad person. Bad person. Was Julia not very nice to you? Are there children here? Not mine. Is that a yes? I'm not sure. Do the children, if there is any, want to play with a teddy? We'll just have a little browse over here while we get Bella Bear, our new little friend. Yeah. We'll just let Dave set up. Oh God. If you hear me shouting out, it's because I've got a bad back. <laughs> Who's got your light? Oh. Yeah, it's on the side. Yeah, it's on the side. Yeah, it's on the side. Remember, she don't sit up either. Yeah. We'll introduce you to Bella Bear in a minute. <laughs> yeah, that's what I heard last time when we were walking that way. It does, yeah, because I heard it when we walked that way earlier. Yeah.
That's a bug. Oh, what did that just say? Can you show yourself in front of me? Camera's like, oh, what's that? Camera keeps going like slightly blurry, like it's focus, trying to focus. Yeah. Can you stand near one of these graves in front of me? Or walk past me? What's that? I'm going to have to go back and look at that. Oh, no. Jensen, oh, it's, my, it's coming out of my mouth. Sorry. <laughs> Can you walk down this path in front of me? Let us see you or hear your footsteps. Zach's walking. Yes. Right, let's introduce you to uh, Hello Bear. Hello Bear. Here she is. Hey Bella. And uh, we've got over here, is that a setup or not? This is the yes and no box. And basically what it does is sensors on either no. side and turn it on, find your pass by light BS for this side and now for that so if it's an intelligent spare you can tell can light BS it'll know to go to this side. So I'll set it up now. Here's what we set up where they kind of won't trip it off. Uh, they walk past it set it off. Maybe by the stone there so I can't go past it like there next to Bella. Okay. And then I can just keep an eye on it, yeah. I'll have to move a bit, a bit, we'll set it off. Oh, she. We're setting up, we're setting up. Jensen! 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 Did someone just throw something at my foot? Did they? There's I heard something there. there. Something hit my boot, it went plonk. I could have been Jess because he's over there and Zach is over there. And I'm standing no, something over there. It literally, I, just, I thought it was the wire, but it's too short. Watch and it hit over here. here. I might turn my camera off for a moment, can not you? Did someone throw something at me? Can you do it again? Throw something at me or Dave? Girl. Is there a girl here? Do you want to play? Jace, you have to be quiet. If there's a girl or a child <laughs> here. Stop. Here he said, don't worry. No, but it's worth it. Yeah. It's worth 60 seconds. If there's a child here, can you go towards the bear in front of us with the green tummy? In fact, like, don't walk over here. It's just going to set that off and keep Jensen back. Go near the bear, he'll light up. Okay. She's very good. Her name's Bella. Do you want to say hello to Bella? I say bear. Bella. Jesus. 
Zaki. 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 Right, be quiet, do as you're told. You. Is it Zach you like? Yeah. Uh, yeah, it said your name. Can you light up the bear? We bring the bear for the children if they want to play. Shall we walk down behind us? I don't know, I just have a feeling to be down there. Down there? Like right behind us, yeah. Right, what we're going to do is stop and we're going to move down that way where we was earlier. Okay, so we're going to head down here. I've heard while we're I didn't have the camera on because obviously we're just sorting the bag out to move. And I heard a young girl's voice sound like it said R-A-P-E. And it sounded again just now before I put the camera on, a man's voice say it again. But I'm not sure if he said break or that word. Oh, I'm getting shivers down here. Is this where you are, down here? Oh, look at that. Are you down here with us? Literally, walking from where you are to me, like, even now I've got shivers. I don't know if that was messing with that, but it all glitched. <laughs> Are you down here? Is this where you want us to come? Yeah. 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 Try it. It's only us here, so. I feel like we should have come down here. Is this is where you want us? Do you want us down here? <laughs> Can you buy a few shots? Right, so we've got, if you can see on that small headstone there, is the yes or no box. Did I say anyone? Can you tell me who threw the stone at my shoe? I'll give you this. Do you want me to throw this stone? Or is that you? Is that you on the white noise? No. No. No, I didn't know. Why is it doing that? I just said run. I said run. Run towards us. We're not gonna run. The phone's going off now. Yeah, the alarm. Run towards us. 
said it again, run. Yeah. If you see a red light, it's the kids. Yeah. It keeps going blurry. Look, your hair is seven, is seven. Whoa, it keeps going well blurry. Are you in front of the camera that I'm holding? Yes. Yes. Can you make it go blurry again? Walk in front of the camera. I don't know if you're going to hear a buzzing, but it's my phone going off and it's in, it's in my bra. <laughs> Let me set you down for a second. So, sorry if it's a bit... Alright, give me a second so I can see. Right, I've got a stone. I'm going to throw the stone. I want you to throw it back for me. I'm just gonna put the camera down. <laughs> Throw the stone. Oh, oh yeah, you can. I was testing if you Dave, Dave, that was so Florida. clear, yeah. Sorry about the beeping, guys. That's it, sorry. Can you tell us the children's names? Are there boy children here? Yeah, yeah. yeah, if you see any like little work well, comes up white on the infrared, but any light is uh, yes. temperature done. Move the camera slightly, guys. There we go. Oh. Right, so we've got Bella Bear, we've got the yes and no box in the middle, and we've got the K2 meter on the other side. Can you touch one of the devices? I want down here. He tells me your name. Tom, are you here with us? Can you talk to us? How old are you, Tom? Oh, 
have it? Yeah. Go. Go. Let's find it. When we go back home, I'll bid you Freddy, yeah? I'll bid you Freddy. Yeah, you can have it when we get to the Are car. Are you around mm -hmm. us? Is that who we can feel? Oh, I didn't talk. This? Yeah. Hey, hey hubby in the car. Is yeah. my mum here? You can have it in the car. Yeah. Yeah. Is my mum with us? Dave, you want to talk to? Dave. 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 Dave.
That's what we're doing. This will be too. Yes. And her voice said yes. Do you want us to take your photo? No. I heard no. William. There's William. The way is William up there, isn't there? On that big one. Yeah. Wait. Hedge, hedgeman. 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 William Hedgeman. I need a problem with family buried here. William Hedgeman, is that you? Is it you that's here with us? Did it? Yeah. Cemetery, we just got cemetery. That's mad. That's mad. It is. <laughs> you can use these voices we have to communicate with us. Can you give us a sign here? here? We don't wish any, mean any disrespect or any harm. We only want to communicate with you if you're here. Step on a wing, like it's like a tashing noise. See if we can hear the noise. Check fast. Did we not hear someone running fast here, Lon? I literally stopped and ran around. Yeah. Bella Bear, Bella Bear. That's what? You. Yeah, that was me. Zach, don't point the laser, Bella. Poltergeist. Poltergeist. Okay. Yeah, me. Yeah. Attack. The woman was murdered. And it's the day she was killed. Julia. Who was attacked? Can you give me their name? Oh, what? Web. Web up here. Web. Web. Katie Webster, are you here? I'm aware of Today was the day you murdered Julia, wasn't it? Katie Webster. <laughs> I killed. Begin. Keep hearing that loud bang, not that bang, but like closer, like. Yeah. Sounded closer. Can we take your photo? No. 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 Was that you, Katie? Leave me alone. Should I? Leave it alone, leave me alone. It's hard to hear when they were shot. Yeah. Katie, I'm a web also. <coughs> David, hey. I said David, just hey. What he? do you hate? You hate. Oh. Just yeah. Can you show yourself around me or behind yeah. you? Chance. Chance. Not my me. Is it on me, yeah? Yeah, he's pointing the laser on you. Oh, just because I said. 
Stroke. Can you show yourself around me or yeah. behind me? What's Pilot. It? Pilot. Jensen, not me eyes. Did, did that just say skin? Did that sound like skin? Don't point for your eyes. Okay. Katie. Run. 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 run on here now. Katie, do you want us to run? I want you to get away. I heard anyway. Do you want us to Do you hear that behind you? Yeah, I heard it. I heard it. Is that true? Is that what you did? Tell us your side of what happened. Why did you do it? Why? 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 I'm cold now. I'm really cold. Like down my arm. Jason, stop. Down. Down. Do you want us to leave now? Do you put leave? On the spirit talker in my hand. If you could say leave on this, we will leave. Say leave. Say leave. leave. Leave now. You want us to leave now? Are we welcome to come back again? Protection. Oh, they're trying okay. to protect us. Because you're like, leave now, we're protecting you. Yeah. We're doing your favour, we're trying to get you over here. Are Might you, be a negative thing. Are you trying to protect us? Yes. 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 Okay, we will leave now, but can we come back and talk to you another time? If you wish. Okay, if you wish. Can we come back in the daytime? Of course. Okay. We've asked us to leave. And we will do so. Can you say goodbye? Husband. Wife and husband. Is that who's trying to protect us? They look closer than what I've seen. Can you say goodbye, please? <laughs> George. Joyce. Joyce. Are you behind me or are you behind David? Mom, we go. David. Is it David? Dave? Are you behind me? 
Can you stay behind David for a minute before we leave? Right, if you're behind David, can you show yourself? We'll we'll leave in a minute, okay? Show yourself around David. Stand next to me. No. Oh, brilliant. I went on and off as quick as I. If I sort of flipped, flipped. Yeah. So I can't see it from here because it's we're at, we're at the back of the no box, but it flashed quickly. No. It just said yes, no. Wait, yes, no. Bye. Bye. Yeah. Can you throw Bye. before we leave? Can you throw something at David? Bye. Can you throw a stick at David? He killed me, but I'm not sure if I've had that one through before. If you come stand next to this box that's in front of me, stand either side of it. If you know what they mean, you can light the green one yes or no. Or just come close to it, or you have the bear. I don't mean you have to you come over, stand next to me. Sound right, it's if David help. Sure. How can I help you? Sure. Tell me how we can help. Can you show yourself near David? You threw a stone at me earlier, can you throw one at Dave? My scarf moved and I didn't move. Did you see it at the bottom? Of it? I wasn't even moving. No, I thought you had it in your hand and dropped it. Yeah, no. You literally lifted up and dropped down. I only saw it just drop down. I thought I didn't think it dropped down. I said, hey, your hands are holding the camera and you're just holding and, the speaker. And the speaker, yeah. And the power bike. You just said go. What? Do you want us to go? It just knocked that off. That was dead. Steady. I'm really cold. I got very cold. Yes. Do you want us to leave right now? Can you push Bella Bear over for us and then we will go, I promise. Push this bear over. <laughs> this one right here I'm pointing at. There's a stick holding up at the back. If you knock the stick over, the bill the bear will fall over. If you knock the box over, would you please do it one more time? And you have my word will leave. That's been sitting there for how long I don't That's what I mean. I'll put it back on slow motion. But my scarf was first and we were just talking about it and then that one went boom. It's almost saying, there. Yeah. Was that you that did that to the Kiwi scarf and then to my box? Did you knock it over? Yes. Straight away, yes. And it didn't go off? No. It didn't go off the side. It didn't go off the side. Front or back. Otherwise, I would have tripped it. 
Okay, thank you, spirits. Thank you, Maddie. You're welcome. Thank you, spirits. We appreciate your time and you talking to us. <laughs> We will come back again. If that's okay. Will you talk to us again if we come back? Oh, she, she said something now. Yeah. Hey guys, so we've ended it now and we're going to be heading home. We hope you enjoyed our investigation at the abandoned cemetery. Barns. Barns. Um, but yeah, so we hope you've enjoyed. We're going to try and do a daytime visit here as well. Um, obviously, the spirits will turn us to leave. Uh, we, we did hear a few like footsteps and things behind us yeah. as we were coming out. So. We got the yes and no box knocked over and yeah. we kind of took the word that, that they did that. So yeah. It could excited. be a protection thing like it said on the spirit. Thing. Could be. It'd be good to see. Negative yeah. coming. You don't know, do you? You don't. Yeah. You but can't always assume it's, it's negative. It could be positive. So. Yeah. My back's killing me. So. so. We we'll have to leave anyway. It's good timing. <laughs> but we'll be back out doing some more locations very soon. So Thank for sure. watching and supporting. Yeah. Please subscribe, like and subscribe. And like, comment down below. Leave us a timestamp if you're here or have seen anything. And uh, yeah, we'll see you next time, guys. Actually. Bye.